Hey team, it's Nola for five on the floor of the Five Reasons Sports Network after the Miami Heat are dominated in game three by the Boston Celtics. They lose by 20. It was never really close today. They looked tight at the very beginning. A lot of shots were short, a lot of turnovers. At one stage of the game, they had six turnovers, just five field goals, and one assist. It seemed like the strategy for the Celtics was make Tyler Hero uncomfortable. After he had 14 assists in the last game, he had just two in this game. They seemed to want him to drive. They didn't want him to get to the pull-ups. And again, he never really was very effective today. Bam Adebayo led the Heat with 20 points and nine rebounds. Um, he was the only one that looked like okay in this game. There were turnovers from Haywood Highsmith and Caleb Martin early. And really what Miami is dealing with right now is Eric Spolster only has about six players he can play. Still no Terry Rozier. DeLon Wright was out today for personal reasons. Of course, still no Jimmy Butler. And Duncan Robinson is a shell of himself. And Kevin Love, it just does not seem like Spolster trusts him to play in this series. He trusts him intellectually, but not athletically. And so at this point, you're pretty much playing six guys. And if those guys don't play well, you're in trouble. I thought Derek White was the real X factor today. I predicted that before the game. Honestly, he scares me more than Jason Tatum does. They've done a good job on Tatum, an okay job on Brown, but White got off in this game, and Porzingis played well early, and the Heat were just overmatched. Can they make this a series still? Well, it is a series. They're down 2-1. That's all that's happened here, but they're going to need to make more adjustments, and honestly, they need to get Terry Rozier back. They need somebody else who can create something out of nothing, get to the basket, make plays for others, and I just don't know if Terry's going to be back for game four. Ethan Skolnick here at the arena where the Heat lose. Now down 2-1 in this series. Boston has dominated in this building over the past couple of years, and that does continue. Check out the coverage on 5 on the Floor, the 5 Reasons Sports Network, and, of course, sign up for prize picks using the code 5.